Okay, here is what I did to hook up my Google Chrome, and this is all new. Looks like they've changed it again since I did this last week, so here we go. So the first thing to do, download the Google Chrome Home, what is it called, Google Home app. Okay, once it's downloaded, it looks like that. There it is. <clears throat> okay, so this is a brand new, I've reset my... Chromecast key so that it's back to factory defaults. So on the new system, we go into the home app. And it's not very intuitive. It doesn't ask us to do anything here. So I figured out you got to click this little button in the top <clears throat> right corner. There you go. Devices. Okay, so it's found mine <clears throat> on my screen. It says 5919 on my phone. Five nine one nine. So we'll go set up. And Chromecast is found. Next. Okay. Connecting to my Wi Fi. You've probably done all this already. Okay, so I'm successfully connected. Do I see on my screen? Yes, I see on my screen. <clears throat> okay, send Chromecast data usage. Just enable. Yes, continue. Selected network has a poor signal quality. Yes, that's okay. And yes, get the Wi Fi password from my phone. And continue. <clears throat> connected to the Wi Fi, okay. I'm connected. Ready to cast. Okay, so if you wanted to cast from your phone, we just go continue. <clears throat> We're gonna leave setup. Go back to the home page. So there's two ways to do it. You can click on a video, or up under home, you can go cast screen. And choose your key that you want to cast it to. And that's what's on my phone, and now that's the same thing that's on my TV, so... Got a video or something you want to show the kids? <clears throat> that's how you do it. Okay. Uh, disconnect. Okay, so our Chromecast has gone to the default. I don't need my phone anymore. And let's go to the computer. Okay, so now on the computer, um, first thing to do is make sure you have the latest version of Google Chrome. So that one, we just go into the corner, these three little dots. Where's my mouse? There it is. And we want to go to settings. Over here on the left, we want about. And right there is Google Chrome is up to date. Good, okay. So now, let's log into the cloud. <clears throat> okay, now uh, what we do is we go to the channel section and you pick the channel that you want to send out to the TV. Now normally, <clears throat> if this was your computer attached TV, you just click this link um, and then the page comes up you would double click on it or hit F11 and it would go f uh, full screen. But the problem is with the Google Chromecast key, we've optimized ours to kind of go full screen. We don't have the three little dots over here. So let's close this. We need those three little dots. So let's go back to the channel that we want to. Let's right click on it and go open in a new window. Okay, so this is the window. This is what we're going to cast. We can make it smaller. 
we have these three dots the settings so let's go over to settings and they have they've just changed this before it used to be quite a process to get extensions working now we just go down to cast okay it does a search there is my cast key I click on it it's telling me yes do you want to cast do you want audio how big is the audio okay so let's close that and my computer is now casting to my TV. The only thing to keep in mind is you can, I believe you can minimize the window. So I minimize the window and everything's still working, yes. Sometimes you actually have to, um, you can't have an oddball shape window before you minimize. Um, because now it's going to have black bars top and bottom and the image sent to the TV doesn't know how to handle it so you always have to have your browser window in the landscape wider than taller and the screen should automatically reboot F5 and the TV's back to normal again so just make sure it's widescreen Minimize, and as long as your screensaver and your power settings are set to always on, so you don't want a screensaver and you don't want the computer to sleep, uh, it should cast 24-7. So on a daily basis, you can either set your browser up to automatically open Google Chrome and go to the default web address you want, this one, whichever channel you want, or you log in on a daily basis, right click, Open it in a new window and hit the cast. And that's hopefully going to get you going.